So Lance, welcome back to Cape Town, to your hometown, and to Ajax Cape Town for your second uh, time around. Uh, go through how the whole deal happened and what's been happening on the side of Europe and now that you're finally here. Well, it was, you know, I was unsatisfied uh, in, in Europe. I wasn't getting so much game time and our club was going through a lot of problems, but, you know, inside problems. And uh, my agent and I had a chat. And, uh, <clears throat> sorry, and I always told him that if, if it's going to be South Africa, it's going to be only Ajax Cape Town. And uh, the setup is perfect, just like European, and I was happy to come back. And especially now that uh, we have a European coach, it will be much easier for myself again to come back. Because the last time when I got back, it was a little bit difficult getting into the systems and things, so it's, it's much easier for myself. Many people will say your last time at Ajax was some of the best football We've seen you, South Africans have seen you play for a while. You, you got into the swing of things really quickly and uh, you seem to enjoy yourself. Can you just run us through how it, how it was playing in that short stint? No, you know, uh, it was also the, uh, Pop was also the big man behind it. You know, he was playing European football. It was an Ajax system. It wasn't, that di it wasn't difficult. And I had players, it was not myself only. I had players, good players around me and we were a good team. We, we knew what Foppa wanted. And he, he gave a good foundation, and it was, I enjoyed my football also. I scored goals as a defensive midfielder. It was really, it was fun to play. And the setup is also like a European, and it's five star year eyes, and that's what, that's what I enjoy the most about it. And what have you heard so far from the new coach and in terms of how he wants to use you? Will it be a very similar role to the previous time? Well, it's going to be a similar role he wanted me, and of course, he says I'm bringing the experience because we have all the lot of young players that we have. But you know, I've heard a lot since I've been in, in Europe because I've always been monitored in Ajax, and uh, from what I've seen, uh, it's not a, not a bad team at all. Uh, we we have, we have a lot of young players, yes, but and you know, of course, there's letters but se senior players that that we, that we that we have that the coaches brought in, and I don't think that we should have a problem going th going forward. And your thoughts on the other new signings, Mabuti Kenyeza, obviously a proven goal scorer, been here before, and then Abi Anale, who can add something on the wings behind the striker. What are your thoughts about them coming in as well to help the team out? Of course, of course Mabuti has a lot of experience, good values, also played at ice, so he scored a lot of goals, and we need a guy, up, 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 a guy like that up in front just to make a lot of, how can I say, he's always rattling and giving um, defenders problems. Abi Anale is another guy also with, uh, with international experience, played for Bufana, and he's a guy that can give a lot of goals and give a lot of assists for us. And then personally, your targets, how long is your contract now with the team? And are there any ambitions to finish your career somewhere in this area? Maybe another t a chance in Europe? What's going through your mind at this, at this point? At the moment, my only mission is Ajax, Ajax, and to stay in the PSL. That's all. Good. And quite, quite frankly, top eight is where Ajax feel they belong. Do you think there's still a chance of finishing in the top eight or even a higher position for that matter? Well, what I heard in the, in the coach said, you know, if our team has consistency now in the, ne the next half of the season, then I don't think there should be a problem being a top eight. But the mo most important thing, we have to take a game by game, and every game is going to be a final for us. Good stuff. Thanks, Lance, and we wish you all the best. Eh? Thanks, man. Cheers.